Hello, we're happy to announce that all model year 2022 and newer PNS Freightliner sleepers will now be equipped with an Eaton 1800 watt pure sign power inverter as seen here. Power inverters take the truck's DC or direct current power and turn it into alternating current or AC power that we're accustomed to with our home appliances. So now appliances such as microwaves, TVs, DVD players, laptops, and even CPAP machines are all safe to use with pure sign inverters. Your inverter is rated for 1800 watts of output. Be sure to check your device's wattage when running multiple devices. Typically, this can be found on a sticker on the bottom or back of your device. Appliances such as microwaves, electric tea kettles, toaster ovens, and coffee makers are considered high wattage devices. So running multiple of these at one time may cause the inverter to trip or cut out. We'll show you how to reset the inverter in just a moment. Your inverter is mounted in the driver's side baggage compartment and protected by metal housing. Please keep the area inside this housing clear to ensure sufficient airflow and not cause the inverter to overheat. You also have three AC plugs mounted inside the cab. One at the base of the refrigerator mounting plate, one in the microwave cabinet, and one at the base of the lower bunk. If your truck is equipped with a battery disconnect switch, typically located outboard of the driver's seat, make sure the switch is in the on position. The truck does not have to be running. The control panel for the inverter is located in the sleeper bunk near the rear AC controls and the Webasto bunk heater controller. Push and hold the power button on the left for approximately one second until you hear the beep. Then let off the button and the controller will light up to indicate the inverter is on. The source or select button on the right lets you scroll through the different functions to see how much wattage you're pulling, how much wattage is available, the battery disconnect voltage, alarm settings, default settings, and back to the beginning, which is the current voltage of your truck's batteries. To turn off the inverter, simply hold the power button again until you hear the beep, release, and the display goes blank. If you have an inverter powered up, but you are not getting power to the outlets, first check your battery voltage level to ensure you are above 12.1 volts. You can see this on the dash shown here. The inverters are programmed to cut out once your truck's battery voltage hits 12.1 volts to ensure you have sufficient power to still crank your truck. Secondly, check the test and reset buttons physically on the inverter. These are easily accessible on the face of the inverter from the side box. To look at this video or any other video regarding the Freightliner products, please visit www.freightlinerpns spell out the word and dot com and click driver resources in the upper left. If you still have additional questions, please click the contact us link in the upper right hand corner and send us a message. Again, thank you for being a PS Logistics driver and stay safe.